to a new video. Today I am doing another Disney haul and I am so excited. I will have already uploaded the vlog that I did for um, my Disneyland trip this time. It was just a quick little weekend trip, trip, but I had so much fun. It was mostly nice weather. The second day was a little warmer. Um, that was probably our summer trip that we'll have and then we'll wait until the fall. Um, but it was just such a fun time. I, I wouldn't say I restrained myself um yeah I wouldn't say that but I got a lot of stuff I'm really excited about I thought I would start with the ears so I can wear them for the video um I wasn't going to buy any ears that was like one of the things I wasn't going to do but look at these I had to get these they're tiki room ears and they're just so cute so they've got all the birds on this like fake leather um ear part and then they have the orange leather headband and it says enchanted tiki room on the side they finally don't have the long tags look at that and then it's a green cloth bow and then a little dole whip enamel on the inside like how could i not get these i just don't think that is an option so tiki room ears 10 out of 10. Um, let's get into the other stuff that I got. So this is probably my biggest purchase and is it ridiculous? Yes. Am I so excited to style it? Also yes. So this is a dress from the Disney 100 collection. Look at it. It is just the absolute cutest. So it's got this really cute like Disneyland print um, that they've been using on a couple things like variations of. They have it on that button up shirt as well but this is in like a baby doll kind of style dress with this ridiculously adorable collar it literally looks like a child's dress but it's in adult sizes and i love that that's basically always my goal so i just think it's so cute it's just like really nice cotton um so it's nice and comfortable and i just think i could do really good things with this dress i just feel like uh, my next Disney trip it will be the outfit I wear to downtown Disney to like hang around I'd like to wear it into the parks but I don't know if it'd be comfortable enough for the parks just because it's a dress um, but it's got the same pattern on the back these are the sleeves it it's just the cutest thing I've ever seen um, I got it in a 1x I think it's fairly true to size um, if running a little big, but I wanted mine to be a little looser and then I was gonna wear um, a belt to kind of cinch it in in the middle and then I thought it would be so cute with some like sparkly pink nylons if I can find them um, and then I've got like the Mary Jane Doc Martens and I just think that will be so cute so and it was $49 so honestly not that bad with price um, I feel like for a dress that's a pretty normal price so I'm really really excited about that next we'll keep going with apparel I got this shirt um, I got this in the little gift shop in Cars Land but this is just a Disneyland shirt I just really liked the like vintagey look of it um, it's just this nice Disneyland um, with the Fab Five on there um, I got this in the extra large I might cut it off into a crop top I'm not sure um, I wish there was like an easier way to do that or like if I, if I could pin it somehow I don't know um, but I really really like this design it's very simple very basic it's a very good everyday tee it's a very um, thin t-shirt which I almost kind of like better than like a thicker t-shirt because um, then it's better for like hot days and it's just more comfortable but I could definitely see myself wearing this to the parks with my um, uh, Disney 100 ears so I am very excited about that one and then I only got one other shirt um, this is from the new Guardians of the Galaxy volume 3 collection they had in the Marvel surplus store um, I don't usually like go for stuff that has like a lot of characters on it and stuff like this but this was just so cute and I loved Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3 so much I had to get it so on the front it's got the little emblem from for them and it says it's good to have friends and it's a boxy crop top I really like the like shape of the boxy crop tops that they make and I wish all the shirts came in that option 
um because I have a couple of them I really like them and then it's got all of the guardians on the back I think it's a really nice color I like that it's kind of cartoon stylized so it's not just a random picture I will say this screen printing um definitely is kind of thick there was another shirt there, a Spider-Man shirt that I really liked, but the screen printing was so thick. It was like the thick rubber that I knew I would not ever want to wear it. Um, but this one isn't as bad. It's a really soft cotton, and I just really, I just really am loving the Guardians right now. We've got all of them. We've got Mantis, Groot, Drax, Nebula, Rocket, and Star-Lord. I guess we don't have Gamora on here, but if you've seen Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3, that kind of makes sense after everything that happened in Endgame. Um, She's a guardian, but not quite anymore, so, okay. I loved the Marvel Surplus store. I had um, a hard time restraining myself in there. The other thing I got was this Rocket Guardians of the Galaxy Pop Funko, and you know what, I'm gonna open this right now so I can put it on my shelf. Um, I'm not one of those people that doesn't open the Pop Funkos. I really, I don't care that much, but um, I just think he is so, Cute. I'm like he comes with a stand. He must be able to stand on his own really well because um, he doesn't have a little plastic stand. I mean, are you kidding? In his little Guardians uniform? Yeah. I was torn between Rocket and Adam Warlock, but when it comes down to it, Rocket is probably my favorite character in the Guardians. Um, I have Gamora and I have Nebula up on my very top shelf, so I can't reach them. So he'll join his little Guardians friends and he's just the cutest I there was a lot of guardian stuff that I wanted to get and there is still more um, I got this Loki pin as a gift for someone um, I have that actually myself already I had to buy a second pin banner because I ran out of room here's a pin I got for me I was so excited that there was still at least some avatar merch so I got this avatar pin and just look how cool the like it's like clear like glass on the inside there were a couple avatar pins but this was definitely the one I liked the most um, it's a double back pin and I just I mean I'll take any avatar merch but I was really really excited to see this I think it is so cute I also bought that in Cars Land um, so I didn't see as many pins like I didn't see hardly any new releases other than the Star Wars stuff um, for May the 4th like I don't know why the pin like selection just didn't seem like that great or if I just wasn't looking in the right places but and then I told you I had mo I got more Guardian stuff this is a Rocket and Groot pin and I think it is so freaking cute I love the like shiny enamelness of it and it's still kind of like baby Groot I thought that was so cute to add to my collection I do already have a Guardians pin I got one at the um the Guardians of the Galaxy ride in Epcot just because it was a new ride to like celebrate that I went on a new ride basically um and then you know what there is one more pin in here oh I got this as a gift for someone else as well this is the Millennium Falcon Pride Collection pin um that'll go to the same person getting the Loki pin and then they wrapped this up for me I'm actually I'm gonna fill this up today I got this water bottle because it is just the cutest Thing. and I don't think I've ever seen this like hydro flask style if I'm not mistaken uh, they have the cups that have just the twist tops but this is a twist top um, that has a straw which is uh, what I prefer so I'm definitely going to go fill this up with some water after this video um, so I got this because I love the colors and I love the checkered board and I love the flowers and I not like Bambi's number one fan or anything but this character I believe is called something flower or just called flower um but my childhood dog we named him after this character so I just thought it was a sign so I got this water bottle and it's so funny a couple days after I got that my sister sent a picture she works at Disney World she sent a picture in the family group chat she's like should I get this it's like it's like our dog and I was like I already bought it so um I think is that it I think that's it I think I made it through see now when it's all laid out in front I feel like I didn't do that bad I got some like practical things I got some pins and I got some clothes, so nothing too crazy. And the ears. The ears were probably my biggest impulse purchase. But um, I really love the tiki room, okay? So 
Um, I hope you enjoyed this haul. I think my favorite thing, honestly, might be this little rocket or the Tiki Room ears, but I'm gonna go put him with his other little Guardians friends um, and I will be setting up my pin board. Maybe I'll do a video on my pin collection sometime soon. That'd be kind of fun, wouldn't it? Um, I have a lot of pins ranging from, I think I started collecting pins when I was like 13. I'm 25 now. Um, so I have pins from quite a while ago <laughs> to now. Um, if anything, you could say some of those pins are vintage at this point. Um, so I think that'll be really fun. Maybe I'll film that later today. But I hope you enjoyed this haul. I love Disney, obviously, so much. We now have year passes to Disneyland um, that we will be activating probably in the fall. So I am very excited to uh, be able to go more often. And I'm hoping to plan some trips with some other family members and stuff. So I will obviously have plenty of more hauls coming in the future. Um, but I hope you enjoyed this video. Like, share, subscribe. I upload booktube content and I am foraying into Disney content as well. So I hope to see you again sometime soon. Uh, see you next time.